Okay, can I do it? Find him. Hang on, filming. Go back, Houston. Go to California. I'm talking to the intro and stuff. I don't want it to be so much noise. Hey guys, welcome back to me. How are you guys? Today, we're going to do a Pongo Dindo UC fan. Simple Dindo. Okay. This one do the bus feed news. So. Sorry. Quiet. And enjoy 50,000 bonus miles. United Explorer card. Smells like soap. It's shampoo season, and if you leave them in the ground, they refill on their own. I discovered it actually in my own yard. I didn't even know what it was. So I started researching there because I think it's important that we start local or start within our yard, starting to get I'm to know our own weeds. And of course, this is not a native here. It was planted previously. Yeah. And yeah. I started to yeah. research yeah. it and yeah. learned yeah. that in Hawaii, the women would use it to wash their hair near the waterfalls. And you can strain this if you'd like. I'm just going to wash my hands a little bit before I actually put it on my face. I lost my head due to a brain injury, so I lost my taste and my smell. I've been using it for like 10 years. I remember the smell. It smells amazing, and I can get I can get a little sense of it. Because I am still healing and recovering. I've, I've been getting a lot of people have never even heard of the plant, and it, it is very interesting that a cleanser would come out of a cone. It's a great cleanser, and normally I wouldn't rinse it out until I would go inside after doing my yard work. I love just letting it sit in the air. It is a shampoo ginger lily. That's the common name used here. Different common names out in Hawaii. Yeah, yeah, pine cone dindo wild ginger, bitter ginger, pine cone ginger, and it's a great conditioner as well. That's right, That's all we do. Just got done with every video doing it. Conditioning effect on the hair and the skin. It's super yeah. soft. Like I said, it doesn't leave a sticky residue. It's super soft. So I'm going to go rinse and show you guys yeah, what it looks like after. But my hair is like super, super, super soft right now. It feels so good. Turn. What? Okay, it's not that much of a back on this over there. I know anything about everyone's allergies in here. I don't know if your hair is dyed, bleached, damaged. I don't know what you've got going on. So do your research. I filled my jar up with cold well water. This is just well water. I'm going to do a final rinse. And that's it. <laughs> I'm glad that I can share the thoughts with you guys. Filming a video. It's amazing. I think people are just amazed. <laughs> oh, sorry, Dad. I didn't even hit you. Today's permaculture plant spotlight is the shampoo ginger or pine cone ginger. Now this is a beautifully diverse plant because a lot of the different parts of the plant have very specific. I'm actually gonna collab with a couple of people soon, but I don't, don't want to tell you who it is. Tall, and when they're burned and the ashes are saved, uh, those preserved ashes can be used on minor cuts, scrapes, abrasions, or healing of bruises. The pine cones at the base, although they're green when they're young, they do turn a little bit more red when they're older. This is too all way red. Here are edible, and when you squeeze the cones, edible? this awesome juice comes out. The nectar that comes that out of the pine cone so is great on hair. It's good for skin. It's good for nails. You can actually use it as a shampoo. The watery substance will save for a couple days and 
Do you want to stop, stop slamming up my door, Wiley? But it's really good. Sorry, guys, Wiley. Slamming the door again. Is edible. My favorite. Wait, it's edible? Culture plant spotlight is the shampoo ginger. This is a beautifully diverse plant because a lot of the different parts of the plant have very specific uses. The beautiful green leaves of the plant can get to be seven to eight. This is about the food being um, um, edible. I know, that's why I said look up all the uses. I didn't think I watched it. Like in the issue, you can't say so. There's a lot deep rating. It doesn't taste good, so you wouldn't want to eat it. Oh, well, I don't care if it didn't taste good. What? Come on. Come on. Taste it. Can I taste it? Okay. Get all the information first. I'm always thinking about collabing with two people. Just do your stuff. Aww. I can't say on camera, man, I want to be a surprise. Huh, I'm waiting for the love. Good right. Sleep on the same one. No, it's pause. This is probably going to do the issues. It's so specific. I'm sure okay, you can drink it too, the soap, I guess. But you don't know that, so you don't tell people that. Right? No, no, I'm not. Somebody That's only it. dumb enough to do it, except you're on Google, so I don't leave it. Medical application in Ashanti and Flame Toy and Ties are real. Huh? Both and for various types of pain management. Generally, not toxic to dogs. And t cats. Each fishing can also walk. Dental plant or. Somebody must have the dog eat it already.